boy John for the Game Review here, welcoming you back to another episode of The Saga Lock. Hopefully everything is going well, everything is exciting. If you guys are not familiar with this, it is a series where we literally are going through all eight generations. Y'all should be familiar because it's literally episode 143. Um, let's go ahead and do a quick team recap because we have a new member. Yay, we love it. We have our Einstein with the left yank, Earth Power Reflect, Dual Chop, and Surf. We have Red, the Scolipede with Stall, Bug Bite, Sludge, Electro Ball, Coil. We have Brittany, Mild Nature, Surf, Swift, Aqua Jet, Fly. We have Mary, our Obama Snow, with Oblivious, Mega Drain, Energy Ball, Icy Wind, Synthesis. We have Gwen with our Wonder Guard, Rollout, Reflect Type, Surf, Water Spout. And our new member of the day, we have a naive, angry Dino, who doesn't know why he's angry, but just knows he's angry, with the Scope Lens. With the moves Rock Slide, Stone Edge, Retaliate, Sky Attack, and Super Luck as an ability, which means a lot of things, actually. Um, we have two Rock types on the team, which is now a little bit scary. I don't like having multiple, uh, you know, duplicate typings, and here we are having duplicate typings. So, and we we don't just have a little bit of duplicate duplication here. We we have a lot more than I would want, right? Uh, again, for somebody who does not like type duplication, we've had quite a bit of it. Lot we had, we had at 1.3 fighting types, like type duplication, like has just been something we've had to deal with. I need to buy some more super potions. Uh, if I would have forgotten to do that, I would have been a little triggered, just just minutely triggered. But we are gonna make it work. We are gonna make our way over through Dragon Spiral Tower, and hopefully, just hopefully, end up also going and doing relic castle today too so like if we can kill those two birds with one stone i will be very very happy because honestly it is really insane how far we are and what we've gotten to and everything that's going on like it doesn't feel right we talked to bianca joy bianca or bianca joy we talked to joy uh and joy said that she's worried for us and nervous for us and i appreciate her worry um because you know it just means that she loves cares for us but we already knew that because it's joy and joy's amazing and yeah so uh well let's see if we would have waited to get our encounter what we've gotten <laughs> okay so to be fair i got the best pokemon i could have in this in dragon spiral tower which was the uh the, the tyranitar but i really 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 want oh my god that was a good encounter or that would have been good. Um, but I really wanted to have Magikarp because I haven't had one yet. I literally haven't had one in the series. It's kind of crazy. I think we already knew that Ferrothorn had Drizzle. But like, bruv. If we didn't know that until just now, then that's really sad. Also, I need to use freaking repels in here. Apparently, because I didn't think that, you know, this area needed 800... Like, it got, gave me 800 Pokemon. But apparently it does. And I'm sorry, Joy. My... It's still a mess. It is still a massive mess. Do I not even have a Repel anymore? No, there it is. Okay. My one singular Repel. I think that's all I have, though. Yeah, it is. Okay. Cool. We only have one repel. So, I mean, we gotta make it count. That's all That's all that, that means. We gotta make this count. Is, is something going on on top of the tower? Um. Uh. Codename. You can walk on the following columns. I'm gonna go after Team Plasma. Okay, Jonas. Okay. Let's, let's do it. I believe. I believe in us, Jonas. We can do this. We found a pointless item. Yay. Don't we love pointless items? But yeah, it makes sense that they tell us, like, hey, you can do this thing. Because it really... If you didn't, if the game didn't tell you that you could do the thing... Oh my god. First step that we can actually get an encounter. We get an encounter. What the heck. Game, we love you, but not that much. Oh my freaking word. This area is... I need to get out of here. Stat! Especially with Arena Trap Mons now, too. But yeah, how was everybody's day on this wonderful Super Bowl? No. Tuesday. 
last episode of Super Bowl Sunday. Oh my gosh. But yeah, no, how is everybody's... How did... Do you guys enjoy the Super Bowl? That is the comic question of the day, because now it's a couple of days. People have watched it. People are chilling. It's been a good... Hopefully a good Super Bowl. I'm not 100% sure. I can't guarantee that, because I haven't watched it yet. Because I'm actually recording, again, decently early. Um, so I'm doing actually really good in that respect lately, and just being on top of things. And I love it when that happens. I love when I'm on top of things, because I just know that, hey, we're killing it. And, like, honestly, the month of February, I have been on top of a lot of things as far as the YouTube world, as far as the work world, and then as far as the school world, too. Like, it has definitely been a month of just getting through and doing things. Uh, so, and, it, and it's been nice. It's been nice to feel productive and to feel like I'm doing things and being active, except for cleaning my room because, you know, it's a room. It's whatever. Uh, but that is the, the one thing that I need to work on the most, I think, is just cleaning my room and getting my room situated because... Eating healthier has been a thing I've been doing, you know, staying more productive and more on task is a thing that I've been doing in February. Like, February has been a good month of improvement, and I've loved it a lot. It's just, yeah, there's obviously, uh, at any time, there's going to be some quirks and things that, you know, you could get better at. But, you never know. I couldn't send in Dino. Um... I don't know how I how we're gonna deal with Dino and what Dino's gonna be like how Dino is gonna be for us because Dino could literally be the mon that wrecks it all honestly Dino could be great Dino could also be really bad like Dino like it's being that sweeper type Dino's really meant to be in the front of the party or as a nose a known switch in but yeah, like I said, I don't quite understand how to utilize Dino, what I want to do. Um, and Angry Dino. Angry Dino is going to be angry because Dino won't be, like, literally heard or anything. But it's fine. We love Dino. Joy knows this. It's just... You have slow start. I remembered that. Yes, okay. I was like, I swear I remembered that game please please tell me i'm not crazy oh my god oh no way gwen i need you and you know what i'm gonna reflect your type i'm weak to the same like a lot less things um and i'm uh dual dually weak to them rather than quad so it makes sense i lose my staff on my rollouts but honestly that's fine Oh, I forgot to give Gwen. That's I knew I forgot something. So during grinding, I I, I was like, I swear, I'm forgetting something. John, you're forgetting something. John, you're forgetting something. Was literally in the back of my head the entire time, and I'm like, what am I forgetting? Like, what could it be? So I forgot to go to the the name, the name raider thing. Um, so that's what I forgot. Which is good to know. At least I fi we figured out what I forgot. Yeah! Wow! Okay. Freaking... Can't get touched over here. But yeah, so that's what I forgot. I, I forgot to get uh, Earth Power back. Which, again, does Earth Power really help Gwen a lot? Not not truly. Like, truly, it it's literally just because the, uh, the upgrade over Surf um, just makes Gwen a lot better, but... Ember. How do I feel? I feel good. Like, I feel like this is like, oh, oh well, this is not a good matchup. Um, but like I said, this episode, I feel like this episode is going to go well. I feel like we're going to go places and it's going to be exciting, right? Like, because literally we go to Relic Castle next after this whole section. Then it's boom, boom, bridge, route nine, gym eight. That is literally, like, after this episode, it's Bridge, Route 9, Gem 8. Bridge is easy because we literally, I think we actually fight Bianca Joy for the final time. Um, why do I keep calling her Bianca Joy? It's, uh, it's Joy. We keep fighting Joy for the last time. And it's, it's gonna be, it's gonna be insane. I, I, I have a feeling that the last fight with Joy is going to be not what we expect of it but also it's going to it's going to make its way for some fun right like i don't I, I don't see the last fight with joy 
being anticlimactic. I feel like it's going to be a good fight. I feel like anything is subject to happen. Castelia Cone, please. I have three of them for some reason. Like, I don't know how... How that ended up happening, but it did. And, you know, I'll take it. It's 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 good. It, it'd be good. Jeez. Woo! We're so close. Like, like... I, 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 I refuse to believe that we're so close to the end. Like, my body and my brain once just refuses to believe where we are sitting currently. Like, we're about to go to Generation 6, everybody. Generation 6. And, oh, Generation 6 is going to be super duper scary. And I know this. I know it's gonna be scary. God. And, like, I'm planning some fun for Generation 6. I'm getting emotional because I'm, like, super scared of it. Um. But, yeah, like. Generation 6. Like, this adventure has been so fun, right? I have loved Pokemon Black, like, this game, so much. This has definitely been one of my favorite adventures. Yeah, there's been death. Yeah, there's been a whole bunch of stuff. But, like, also... A set, even though there's been so much negative, there's always there's always been so much positive to supplement this, right? I feel like this has been a roller coaster of generation. It, it truly has. I think... I think it almost, almost hits harder than Hoenn does. Because Hoenn... Hoenn had the roller... Like, the, the big... Like... Like, I don't even know. Like, Hoenn, Hoenn was more, like, spaced out and stuff. Whereas this is just, like, a lot of the death and the coming out parties for all these Pokemon have been recent, right? So, it's like, they have, they ha all, I think all of these Pokemon have a further story to share um, in the future, like, games. I think all of them do. Um, like, there's a potential for every single one of these mods. And... I think that's where... I'm excited, right? That's what I'm excited about. Where is the potential, and what is the potential of all of the rest of this, these, this, these mods? And what is going to... Like, get shown? Where is it gonna go? How is it gonna do... And, like, who is going to shine is the other question, right? Who is going to shine? Because it could be any single one of these ones that shine and say, Hey, y'all, I'm here. I do, I, I, I do what I do, though. And only three of them will go with us. And realistically, basic, basically only two. Because of uh, the way the pacing is looking. Because, yes, ta by, by technicality, three are going, and then one's dying, basically, immediately. Um, so... It's sad, right? Because they're dying, and that's... Like, it's sad that the Pokemon are dead. But also... Like... We're adventuring to a new game. A new area, a new everything, and just just to adventure out here is huge. Just to say that we existed and we are just gonna be big chilling in Unova or uh, in Kalos. I keep saying Unova, but that's where we are now. Is just it's 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 insane. Because a lot of it, I think, is I just don't feel like I should be where I'm at in the game. But yet, we we are. So, I, I there clearly something happened correctly. Or else I wouldn't be, you know, where I'm at and in the game. To the severity of which that I am. Because, like I said, anything, anything is possible. No matter what craziness, I think we could any we could literally 
accomplish any task. And it's just who's accomplishing the task with me. That ends up being the question. Who is going to accomplish this task with me? And it's shocking. Yes. Ah. Oh! Like, yeah, who's, who's accomplishing the task with me? Oh. That is a new fossil that we have not gotten yet. It's finally time that our Lord N will become a hero. What? Someone made it clear up here? Now, stop that trainer for our Lord N. Go! 4-1 trainer fights. Yes! Y'all have... Oh, no, no, I was wrong. Okay. I, okay, I got... Okay, I didn't know you had two Pokemon. Okay, like, you know... I, I, I thought you had one. That's my bad. I'm sorry. Don't don't hurt me. Don't don't harm me for the fact that I was silly and thought wrong. I mean, that's a one shot, right? Oh my god. Oh, but they murdered themselves three coil. They've been doing that, and you know what? Keep it up. Keep keep murdering yourself three coil. I I that's fine. If you want to murder yourself with the recoil damage, go for it. Murder yourself with the recoil damage. That. You can you can do that and I won't be mad. Red. That that that's something for Red to take on. Honestly. Red Red I honestly, if there's a Pokemon that has a potential that I th I personally think has potential to grow, it's Red. I think Red's potential has yet to, is definitely yet to be unlocked because of the negative ability. Like, you subtract this negative ability, and Red would probably be going ham in every episode. I'd probably be leading with Red, to be honest. Because, like, Wonder Guard Corsola is just the big red button, right? That's basically what Wonder Guard Corsola is. I want to get used to the rest of the team and see how they function and what they do. Because I know why Corsola is a god. Like, I could run the rest of the game with Corsola. Um, and, you know, we'd be okay. But that's no fun. It really isn't. Like, to run the game with a Pokemon I already know is going to murder things, like, no. No no reason to. Like, honestly. Not not a, not a reason to do that. And so that's why I just, I've decided I don't want to do that. That's not how I want to play the game. Um, the other thing is I'm trying not to overlevel. <laughs> but 48 is literally the next gym. And we're already running across that and we like literally trained up to like 44 crabby mary get out here cool see and like so i'm, I'm gonna just, uh, i guess like uh, i gotta put mary in the lead now after this whole big shebang mary goes to the front of the party because again i'm not putting red in the front of the party red can't go there red unfortunately is kind of Busted is not the right word. Red is not a nuisance. Red is not that great of a Pokemon. And I can't utilize red the way I want to. So it's hard. It makes it more difficult to try and utilize. Oh, now I'll definitely just murder the Macargo and then put, um, put Mary in the front. Mary does have a quad weakness, though. And I, that does scare me. Quad weaknesses are always scary. But... I do have to kind of just let things happen. And we gotta see what's happening. So, we're gonna go ahead and after this fight, we get to talk to Lord N. What do you think, codename? 
How do you like the powerful form of the Pokemon who appears right before and fights beside the hero that would lead the way to a new world? Now, Zekrom and I will head to the Pokemon League, defeat the champion, and this will be the last of the Pokemon battles that hurt Pokemon so. A world for Pokemon alone. It is finally becoming a reality. If you want to stop me, you must become a hero as well. That's right. When Zekrom's counterpart, Reshram, recognizes you, we will finally be even. And then you can try and stop us. What will you do? My prediction, if the future that I see is true, you will meet Reshram. The Pokemon with you believe in you strongly. Will you be the one who interferes with my formula of changing the world? If you want to protect the bounds between people and Pokemon, you must search for Reshram. I'm sure it'll be waiting for you in the form of a light stone. Did you see? The end just flew off. How could this happen? Why? Did that guy N? That was that guy N, right? Why does he have a legendary? I should have the legendary. Ugh. Also, I did hear him tell you to search for the other legendary Pokemon. Calm down, come on. Come on, come on, come on. It's more important that we just do stupid stuff. Okay. I'm okay with doing stupid stuff. Ah, astounding. I would never have imagined a legendary blah, blah, blah. <gasps> there are two legendary. Okay, Joy knows better. Joy Joy would not Joy would not be like, oh my god, girls. There's two of them? <gasps> what? No, like, honestly. I feel like... The, I feel bad. Bianca gets the blunt, or like the blunt, the brunt force of just stupidity that whacked into her character. And it's just like, but she's smart though. Like, make her smart. Like, if she's supposed to be a smart character, make her smart. Okay? Like, I know Sharon's supposed to be like the overly super smart one. But like, Bianca, Bianca doesn't have to be dumb for Sharon to be smart. But I feel like that is such a big misconception is that one character has to be dumb for the other to be smart. Because honestly, you could have two smart characters in a show and be it'd be totally fine. Time to talk to Lenora. I believe. No? Oh, no, no, no. We go to the place first. I think. Do we go to Relic Castle first? Um, we'll meet you guys where I'm supposed to go. I'm just gonna make sure that I do it correctly, because... I want to make you guys go to the right place. And actually, well, I say that, and I can literally see you guys in the next episode when we do this. Because it's about that time anyways. Love you all. Bye.